It's a 15,000 square foot mansion. The most expensive thing in this room is the marble wall. Good morning, good morning, good morning. What is up everyone? Welcome back to another video. So today we have a very exciting video. I know you guys have clicked on the video for a reason. We are in Dubai and we're gonna be showing you a crazy mansion. This mansion actually belongs to one of my good friends. Drum roll please. Welcome. So, if you guys have seen my videos, Farooq is someone you know. He actually owns a real estate company. And today, he's not going to be showing us one of the properties he's selling. He's showing us his house. But everything's for sale at the right price, right? Oh, I mean, everything is for sale. <laughs> this place is enormous. Thank so, you. guys, before the video starts, smash the like button, subscribe. It's time for Mansion Tour. <laughs> guys, welcome to my house tour. I'm so excited to show you guys my house and before we get there, let me show you guys my cars. Just to give you guys a little bit of specs about my house, this is a 15,000 square foot mansion. It has six bedrooms, it's built on a 15,000 square foot lot and uh, let's start with my cars. You guys, the first car in the collection is my Range Rover Sport. I love this car, it's a great daily drive back and forth from work. And then my second car over here is the Bentley Continental GT. One of my first favorite cars or more expensive cars that I bought and it's all over my YouTube. So the next car guys, this is a new car that Farouk just bought. Yeah, so this one I just got recently. So you just got a Rolls Royce Ghost. Yes, sir. What I love about this car is the black piano wood finish, the light brown. This is such a smooth car, honestly. Like when I take my clients out in this car, they just love it. Oh no, honestly, it's, it's the best. It's a V-Spec, so it's the higher sort of sporty version of the regular Ghost, which is nice. It's about like 70, 80 horsepower over the regular Ghost. And yeah, really nice car to take clients out to check out properties. So if you guys want to check out properties. <laughs> we'll bring this car just for you guys. We'll bring this car just for you guys. If you make this video reach. We'll be happy with like two million. I mean, uh, I'm, five, five, I'm million, five, million, five million views, guys. Five million views. Let's say 500,000 uh, likes. And uh, yeah, you get to go out in the roads. Okay, guys. Farooq is not a crazy car fanatic. When did you get the Mercedes AMG? A while back. Really? Yeah. Guys, you see, I know yeah. Farooq, but I never it's knew he lives like this. It's man. You gotta, Mo, you gotta watch all my videos now, man. What I love about this particular AMG GT is that this one's been tuned up. It's got the bucket seats, it's got the sporty finish. This car has over 600 horsepower, which is about 100 horsepower extra over the regular AMG GT. What I love about this is the carbon fiber finish, the carbon fiber there, and all the carbon fiber inside. All right. Let's switch it on. So much fun to drive. But unfortunately, my wife doesn't like it. She, <laughs> she finds it hard to get in and out of this car. So I'm like, honestly, ah. I respect that. <laughs> like, guess finally, we got the Maserati. Bro, you know, my favorite car used to be a Maserati. Oh, really? Yeah. I'm going to show you this car as well. Yeah. Wait, is this the cheapest car in the collection? Or the Range Rover? Which one? <laughs> no, no, this one. <laughs> it's a little bit more expensive. But yeah, this is a nice daily drive as well. I personally really like the black color. I love the interior. The way Maserati makes the interiors this is beautiful. So guys, it's time to take you guys inside my house. So let's go. Welcome to my house. You see the drippy, I'm fitted up. Hop in my car and a giddy up. Secure the bag, yeah, I get the bus. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. You see the drippy, I'm fitted up. Hop in my car and a giddy up. Alright, guys, so welcome inside Farooq's mansion. First things first, guys. This is <laughs> humongous. Um, I like this is a kind of a classic house look. It's not the regular modern mansions that they're making nowadays. Uh, this one's built over 15 years ago, but very well kept. We've kept it with a lot of love. Now, as far as I said, guys, it's a 15,000 square foot mansion. I mean, I just love the way it's built. It kind of looks like Drake's house. You know, like the, uh, uh, it looks like the embassy, you know, the embassy, guys. I just love how the house looks like from the outside. For me, that's the most important thing about any house, you know? I agree. I think the first uh, thing that anyone sees is a house, and I love the way that it lights up at night. Uh, that's my favorite part. Plus, we host a lot, so it's great to have people coming over, and uh, the space really helps. Let me take you guys inside. Let me just check if the boss is home. Oh, she is! Hello. Hello, Dad. So, by the way, Mo, meet my wife, Zara. Hi. 
this so, is my first time. I feel very awkward, but I hopefully don't show it. So guys, this is the, just as you enter, we've got a little bit of an entry for you. And we have a informal sitting area over here, and then we have the formal sitting and dining on this side. The reason I wanted Zara to be here is because she's done everything in this house. I really did not contributed anything, right? Yes. <laughs> All right, let's go um, to the main living room. So here I did the flooring, the walls, um, as you can see the only color that I used here was blue because I wanted to have some color but if you can look at the uh, furniture it's basically modern contemporary. My favorite piece definitely has to be this blue sofa. Actually Farooq picked this one and initially when he was picking it I was telling him that I hate it but then when it came all together. Vision guys, this is yeah. called vision. And it's all thanks to Farooq, I'll give him credit for this. All I've got those, an eye, uh, I've got an eye. I've got an eye for beauty. I've got an eye for <laughs> What's the most expensive piece here? The wall, because it's a, it's an original marble wall. Yeah. And it took a lot of convincing to get. Guys, but the craziest thing is, the most expensive thing in this room is the marble wall. <laughs> like, like uh, I don't think that's the I would never pay thing. that. I would never pay for a marble wall. They need a and marble. I think it makes the entire room, the wall. Huh. Without the wall, it would look empty. No yeah. idea. It's guys. art, right? I guess. It is. Yeah, it is. All right, let's move on, guys. <laughs> and then going to the dining. So the table and the chairs were bought separately. And as you can see, the chairs are a little bigger than normal. So you do have that comfort. And also, it looks a bit more formal. And here, we were actually supposed to have an art piece, which we've ordered. It's been three months, but it hasn't the come function. in. Yeah. The are still painting it. I like the fact that this wall is blue. My favorite art piece in my house. So if you see that little piece of modern art, this is specially commissioned for this room as well to go with the beige and gray. And let me take you guys outside before it gets dark. All right, guys, it's time for the 10,000 square foot garden. Welcome to the garden. Uh, this is where we host a lot, and actually, unfortunately in Dubai, it's kind of hot six months of the year, so we don't really use it as much, but that's the pool where Hamdan and I go swimming every, or I try to go every other day after work. My baby loves the swimming pool. We love to put a lot of tables over here and have parties like the one you came to last, this week actually. Shh, don't say that. <laughs> I'm kidding, I'm kidding, you can say that. So guys, this is where I like to come and relax. Back after a long day of work, me and my wife generally yes, come over we here. we definitely do this, right? <laughs> every day, every, every week. Where he sits on the swing after work and I and push And then she him. swings me. Yes. yes. Up here, so it's time to take you upstairs to Farooq's bedroom. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> guys, I, literally this whole video was done just to see his bedroom, guys. So we're gonna take you It's the, 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 the moment we've been waiting for, you know? So this is our picture wall. Well, that's me and my wife on our wedding. Like right before our wedding. Wow. Pretty cool. Oh, that's me when I was a kid. Is, is it all just you? This is our little bedroom. Nothing too fancy. I like simple. You guys, welcome to my bedroom. As you can see, it's uh, very simple, very nice. I love the way my wife has done it. Very elegant. I really like these little lights that uh, we've installed over here, which is kind of cool. But I love the little greys, beige. Soft colors. All right, guys. So this is the longest bed I've ever seen in my life, guys. Look, look at the height of this bed. <laughs> is it taller than you? Guys, you're standing next to it. Definitely is. Guys, look at the, the height of this bed. This is taller than Faru. Thank you so much for checking out my house. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And like every time, guys, don't forget to like this video, subscribe to Mo's channel. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and uh, leave us in the comments below what you guys thought. 